Candice. Take it away, guys. You pick live. You pick live. Make the whole room see it. And we are live on this Monday, April 28th. And it's good to be back from our week off. Yes, it is. Brent, what'd you do? Uh, I saw some movies. I got some holiday shopping done. Holiday shopping? Yeah. Isn't it a little early for that? I mean, it is only April and holiday shopping. I, know, I, know, I, know, I, know. I was still shopping for people from last December. <laughs> catching up. Of course you were. Of course you were. Okay, we've got a great afternoon lined up for you guys today. We've got Carmen Rasmussen yes. from American Idol. She will be here. And... Brittany Snow from American Dreams. Wow, jam-packed day. Let's get to the first pick of the day. You guys have been voting all day at Nick.com. Between Rugrats, Doug, and Cat Dog. Let's get the results up on Uncle Plasma. Richie, zoom in, please. Like you've never zoomed before. And it's Cat Dog. Cat Dog. And Tony was standing by with the winning tape. Hey, hey, what's going on, guys? Pleasure to see you. Nice Question. to see you. Thank you. Have you guys seen Carmen from American Idol? She's supposed to help me with this. I saw her with Pick Boy, dude. Pick Boy? Yeah. <laughs> Get him, Antonio. No, no, Carmen. It's more like this. Pick boy is awesome. Pick boy is awesome. Oh, yeah, pick, so pick boy. What are you doing with our guest? I'm teaching Carmen the uh, the new pick boy theme song. He's such a great host. The host? He's not the host of the show. C Carmen, come, oh. come with me, please. Wait a minute. A nice save, Antonio. Way well done, go, Antonio. <laughs> Barbara, I haven't seen Barbara in a week. Hey, Yay, Barbara. Barbara. Thanks, Carmen. All right, here's your first pick of the day, Cat Dog. Cat Dog. <laughs> Live and joining us now in the lounge is Carmen Rasmussen from American Idol. I can never say the name right. Do you want to pronounce her real name for me? Rasmussen. Rasmussen. All right. So I'm sorry that you didn't win the whole competition, but you had a great time, and uh, I, I can imagine at least. Yeah. What's, what's the best moment that you had? The best moment was walking down the red carpet with all the cameras flashing. That was the funnest. Yeah, I'd like to be there someday. <laughs> all right, any funny or embarrassing moments that happened to you while you were there? One time I was carrying my food tray to go put it away and there was a big cooler and I tripped over the cooler and fell on my elbows and the food oh. went everywhere and it was Did horrible. you get hurt? Just a little, but it was But you're funny. okay? Yeah, I'm okay. All right, you're okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who's the messiest roommate in the house? The messiest is probably Kimberly Caldwell. Kimberly. <laughs> and who do you think is going to win it all? I really don't know. It just depends you don't know? on No, it just depends on who they vote for. They're all good. Do you have any favorites? I don't. I no. love everyone. You like them all? I like them all. Oh, that's so sweet. So, okay. Well, Brent has some um, Nick.com questions for you. Hi, okay. Carmen. Hi. Hi. <laughs> hey, all right. This one's from Lingo1233. Carmen, how did it feel to be the youngest contestant? It was awesome being the youngest contestant. It was really cool, and everyone treated me really good, and we all became best friends. Nice. All right, and this is, uh, how old are you, Carmen? I'm 18 years old. Fantastic! <laughs> and this is a question uh, from L6MV7KVGVV. <laughs> wow. And the question is, if you were stuck on an island, which American Idol contestant would you take, including me? I would take you, definitely. Yes! Aww, how sweet. <laughs> but not me! Because you can't take me. I would take Ricky, probably, because he's my best friend. So Ricky. Ricky and me, great. Thanks. Ricky and you. All right, are you ready for some this or that coming I'm up next? I'm ready. Brent? All right, it's coming up next right after this. <laughs> Nickelodeon has always brought the stars to you, but now Nickelodeon is bringing you to the stars. It's Team Nick Spins the Bottle, and you're playing with your favorite... Let's my glasses right here. There's some people. I like that guy right there. Hey, you're watching Nickelodeon 2 Pick Live. I'm hanging out with Carmen from American Idol. Carmen, give me five. Sweet. Let me give you five. Sweet. All right, Carmen, we're about to play a game called This or That. This or That. Thank you. Um, now, here's how it works. I'm going to give you two choices. Don't think. Okay, just think. Okay. Okay? Okay. Don't get nervous. Start the music. <laughs> Simon, Randy, or Paula? Simon. Whoa! She balked. Hit a high C or slap a high five? High C. High C. All right, sing in the shower or sing on TV with millions of people watching? Shower. Shower! <laughs> uh, best sore throat remedy? Hot tea with lemon or pepperoni pizza? Pepperoni pizza. Of course I knew that one. That was my question. <laughs> Finally, my impression of Simon Cowell eating liver or Randy Jackson in a pet store? Randy Jackson in a pet store. Randy Jackson in a pet store. Yo. 
What's up, dog? How you doing, man? You feeling okay? Cool, dude. Give me five, bro. <laughs> All right, cool, man. All right, Lassie. All right, hey, Carmen, thank you so much for being here. It was fantastic. You got you five so out of five. That's absolutely amazing. Here comes the dog. This is for you. Thank you. Fantastic, you big live. Coming up next, cat dog right here. Cute oh. puppy. Cat dog, your first pick of the day. Right now, we need a postcard for the SpongeBob shout out. SpongeBob shout out. They don't wait. And I'm gonna pick it. And Candace is going to pick it, not her nose, the card. And it, <laughs> oh. and it is Jade from Tennessee. Jade from Tennessee. Jessica, Jessica, will you run the city audio room for us? Go, Jessica! Nice work, Jessica. Way to go! Coming up next is a SpongeBob shout out. Get by your Don't phone, let's Jade. Miss it. I'm serious. Get by your phone. Yay! I'm serious. <laughs> Here's one of your choices for today. I'm to clap today. I'm learning to clap today. Hey, you're watching New Big Live, everybody. We told you we had a busy day here. Yes, we do. Today we have got the star of American Dreams, Brittany Snow. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for being here with us. We have got a lot to do today. We're going to get back to you more later. But right now, what? it's time for the wow. SpongeBob Shoutout. SpongeBob Shoutout. Shout out. Out. Yes, we got Jade from Tennessee on the phone. Jade, you there? Yeah. Hi, you want to say hi to Brittany Snow? Hi. <laughs> hi. Who do you want to send your shout out to? Um, I want to send it out to Crystal and Amber because they're cool and they love SpongeBob. Yeah. Awesome, Brittany. Here comes your SpongeBob shout out, Jade. To Crystal and Amber. Thanks for sending in a postcard, Jade. Bye. Bye. Are y'all ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain! I can't hit <laughs> Can what? Go on a date with Jimmy Riley. You stopped by about a half hour ago, asked my permission to take you out. Nice one. You did? Yes, so here's how it goes. He picks you up at the house, you meet your mother, and you take the bus to the movies. No car. I love the bus. You're home by 10. 10? 9.45. Yes, that was Brittany Snow from American Dreams, and now we're chatting with Brittany. Hello, Brittany. Hello. That wasn't live, of course. Now we're live now. Right, got it. Yes, exactly. <laughs> uh, so, Brittany, we've done some extensive research on you. Um, I hope you're prepared. I, I'm prepared. <laughs> you okay. don't look so prepared. I know. Well, first, <laughs> um, would you like some strawberries? <gasps> Yeah, they're my favorite. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, kind of weird. <laughs> okay, so uh, mm. so your first job was as a model at age three. Mm -hmm. How'd that happen? You have a little something I do. Oh, thanks. thanks. <laughs> that wasn't a question, Brittany. <laughs> oh, man. Um, actually, I started modeling when I was three. I'm um, just like little baby commercials and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And then I got into commercials and um, like little TV shows and pilots and stuff like that mm -hmm. in Orlando. And um, booked a couple of gigs, and then I did a soap opera in New York. Cool. Uh, for three years, and then I got American Dreams. Wow. Yeah. It's like a ladder. Like a little ladder. Yeah. Like, woo! <laughs> All right, so, um, so is it true that you were learning to drive on the show at the same time you were learning to drive in real life? Well, kind of. They actually, the uh, show just taught me how to drive stick shift. And so I didn't know how to drive stick shift before, even okay. though I've had my license. So you could drive automatic. Oh, yeah. That's okay. easy. But the stick shift yeah. part was kind of crazy, and I got to. Like a muscle car, like a Camaro or something, a lot of horsepower. Actually, not so cool. Um, no, it was like a little bug, like <laughs> old 1963. Sweet. It was really bad, and I got to pop the clutch and mess it all up and drive around in circles. Don't awesome. do that at home. <laughs> no, don't do that at home. So you act, you dance, you, you write, and you got to sing on the American Dream soundtrack. How was that? Yes. Um, that was really, really cool. I got to sing with Stacey Arricchio, and um, cool. Vanessa Carlton's on the soundtrack, and B2K, and um, I got to sing with all of them and act with them, so it was really cool. Nice. Yeah. Well, uh, Candace, you got some questions over there for us? Oh, yes, I do. Thanks, Candace. <laughs> this is from Armpit78. Great <laughs> name. Are you anything like your character Meg from American Dreams? Um, yeah, actually I'm a little bit. I'm really passionate about something, which is, of course, acting. And Meg is really passionate about dancing on American Bandstand. And we both like to have a lot of fun and we're respectful of our parents. But, you know, I'm a little bit more wild and crazy where Meg is kind of, you know, always teaching the rules and doing them right. Not me. <laughs> so, Brittany, the other thing that we know about you is we heard you do some crazy loud thing with your toes. Can we hear it? Sure. Okay, Candace, get this stick mic over here. Got it. Go okay, for it. Ready? Brittany. 
That is really bizarre. <laughs> it sounds like like eating Captain Crunch or something, <laughs> some know, cereal or weird. something. That is weird. That's bizarre, Brittany. That's one of the bizarrest things we've ever had on You Pick Live. You're coming back to play this or that with us, okay? Cool. Fantastic. <laughs> she's blushing. You Pick Live. She's, she's blushing. I am. Do it again. They're so great. During the Rooms to Go Spring Sale and Clearance, get elegant seven people. Have you found your... <laughs> This is You Pick Live, and I'm hanging out with Brittany Snow from American Dreams. Up high, down low, right? Oh, oh, no, it, that's not how it goes. You were going to be too slow. I just oh. messed it up. I totally messed it up. Right, you're about to mess it up. We're going to play this or that. This or that. Here's how it works, Brittany. Don't get nervous, okay? <laughs> okay. I'm going to give you two choices. Don't think, just answer. Okay. Start the music. Oh, my God. <laughs> Snow day or school day? Snow day. Wrong. <laughs> Live without, uh, live without a TV or live without a phone? Live without a TV. All right, live without a TV, she's right. Grow up now or grow up in the 60s? Grow up now. Grow up now, she's right. Tough one, Nick Carter or Ryan Phillip? Nick Carter. Nick Carter, she's wrong. Finally, uh, you're well, a singer. Actually, I, wanted... I, 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 Brittany. <laughs> I love you, Brittany. Finally, we're gonna... <laughs> Finally, you're a singer. Sing your highest note or your lowest note. <laughs> oh, Brittany, that was fantastic. Sing your lowest note. <laughs> Uh, okay. <laughs> hey, Brittany Snow, Sean SpongeBob shout outs coming up. You pick live. Nice job. You got what, three out of five, I think you got? Oh, I guess. Bad. It's okay. It's above average. Hi. Hey guys, so yeah. two days left to get your audition tapes in for Nickelodeon Search for the Funniest Kid in America. Get out them video cameras and start getting funny. Take it from the very funny and talented Brittany Snow. What Brent said. Yeah. <laughs> if you're between the age of 9 and 16, you can audition to be the next full-time cast member on All That. Go to Nick.com and get all the details for all your All That. All entries must be postmarked by this Wednesday, April 30th, so hurry. Don't mess up. More You Pick Live after this. <laughs> <laughs> that was really funny. Nickelodeon has... Right now, Brittany Snow. Woo! Yes, and now it's time for the head to head. Head to head. Wow. Brent, nice. What are you doing? Uh, well, well, Brittany can act and she can sing and yeah. she can write, but now we want to see if she can dance. Ooh. Uh oh. <laughs> so what go. do you say we have a you pick dance off? Sound good to you guys? Sounds good to me. All right, oh, yeah. fantastic. Let's get to uh, the head to head perk. Pick first. Let's see what you guys have been voting for here between Hi Arnold and Chalk Zone. Let's get the results up on the plasma screen. Looks like chalk zone to me, baby. All right, Taking it's time for the dance-off. <laughs> now, Brittany and Candace are professionally trained dancers. Bring it over here. <laughs> Don't try this at home. All right, dudes, <laughs> what do you guys want to see? The electric slide or the mashed potato? Electric slide! Sounds right. like they, they want to see the electric slide. All right, here we go. Let's do it. Here we go. Go ahead, girls. Watch out, look out. Oh, oh, she getting freaky. I, <laughs> look out, oh, oh she's doing my move. Oh, she's doing oh, my move. Oh, I can't believe she's just doing my move. Here comes Chuck Zone, your head to head pick of the day. She's rocking oh. my move. Brody's got the chuck. Picked by you guys at Nick.com. We are hanging out with Brittany Snow, star of American Dreams. Is it daily challenge time? Yes, it is, Brittany. You're Not a so. genius. We're excited about today's Daily Challenge. We're going to, uh, it's going to be a poetry reading contest now with actress, dancer, singer, and poet, Brittany Snow, against either me, Candace, or Pick Boy. You nervous? A little, yeah. Yeah, you better be nervous. I haven't written a poem All since right. like, we'll I was in first Brittany's grade. Challenge yeah. You guys pick for a plus, a one-of-a-kind you pick poetry jam right after this. Nice. <laughs> Nickelodeon knows funny. Cats, welcome to the You Pick Poetry Lounge. It's time for the Daily Challenge with our guest, Brittany Snow. All right, let's reveal po Brittany's poetry opponent now so they can start writing. You guys have been voting between either me, Brent, or Pick Boy. Let's see it. Let's see it, dude. Pick 
Pip-Boy. Hey, Pip-Boy, okay. Sweet. All right, the subject of your poem is Pip-Boy. Oh, that's my favorite subject. Yeah. This will be the first ever You Pick Poetry Jam. All right. It's, uh, it's nice to put our guests to work, don't you think, Candace? Definitely. Cool. Okay, we're about ready for the poetry reading from our daily challengers, Brittany Snow and Pip-Boy. Subject of today's poetry is Pip-Boy, of course. You guys ready? All right, let's bring it out, our first poet, Pick Boy. All right. Uh, this, this one, I'm gonna express myself in, in haiku form this afternoon. Cool. This is called Ode to Me, Pick Boy. Hit it, cats. It's good. <laughs> I am so handsome. It's good. My hair is always perfect. Good. I am so handsome. Hey, hey, hey. All right, all right. Okay, now it's Brittany's turn. Yeah, let's get some real poetry up here. This is a poem called Pick Me. A little cat, dog, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Pick me. That superhero with the greatest power makes loungers happy. Happy. Happy, happy, happy. Pick me, just once, and see the boy behind the mask. Pick me, just once. <laughs> that was awesome! All right, yeah, all right, that was great. Right. That was awesome. I don't know, it's a tough decision, Candace. I'm gonna go with Brittany! Uh, what about okay. my haiku? Oh, here's a tissue for you, there you go. Oh, that's okay. water. Yeah. Brittany, thank you so much for being here. We've enjoyed you all afternoon. Thank you. Okay, everybody give it up for Brittany, Brittany Snow. Brittany Snow, all right. All right. Cool. All right. Coming up next is Rocket Power. All right, Brittany Snow, yeah. Nice work, Brittany. Good poetry. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Oh, yeah. It's impossible! What is going on in here? What is his idea? What? We were just getting psyched up for the encore presentation of Jimmy Neutron's Egg Pyre Strikes Back episode. By playing with eggs? Yes. Okay. Whatever, you might as well at least tell him when it's on. Okay. I'll, I'll tell him. Oh, okay. It's uh, Jimmy Neutron, Eggpire Strikes Back, this Wednesday night at 8 p.m. 7 Central. All right, then. Coming up next here is going to be the prize wall. I'll oh, see y'all later. Take this one out. She's gonna... But I'm not afraid. Tell him. You will be. You will be. Ah! Oh, no. Again. All right, let's go. Go, go. Right, let's go. You... The sad people will be back in greater numbers. Yeah, ah. yeah. Are your hands free? To answer a call, to pour some... 24 cents. Yeah, this is getting absolutely out of hand now. The bucket of bucks hasn't been won. The last time it was won was March 11th. Wow. But I remember it like it was seven weeks ago. <laughs> right, someone's... Oh! Eventually, yeah, right? That was a good day. Maybe today. Who knows? Oh. Whoa. Well, it looks like we need a, a lounger. Well, we do. Okay. Oh, pick boy. Pick boy. Yeah, yeah, listen. I know they need their picks, okay? But I'm booked. Hey, hey. Pick boy. I, I, I bet he's talking to a guy. Yeah, what? Well, listen, you just tell him to get someone less qualified, less good looking, okay? I'm booked. I, I got a job to do here. Okay, right. bye. Yeah. Okay. He's talking to a dial tone. Oh, what was that? Oh, uh, you want to pick us a laundry? Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, 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 come on up. Whoa, All it's right. Candace. Hey, what's your name? Mizra. Okay, which door do you want? Um, seven. Door number seven. She chose door number seven. What could be behind door number seven? I'm so nervous. I don't know what I can do with myself. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no. Ooh, a leopard. All right, here you go. You've won a vertical 26-inch, 21-speed, PK7 aluminum mountain bike frame with dual suspension, distributed by Dynacraft. Woo! Nickelodeon search for the funniest kid in America. If you're between the ages of 9 and 16, don't miss a chance to become the newest mass cast member on all that. All entries must be postmarked by
by this Wednesday, April 30th. So get out your video cameras and show us the funny. Show us the funny. That was good, cool, Kenneth. Thank you. Thank Not you very bad. much. Not bad. All right. right. Hey, tomorrow afternoon, Slime Time Live is going Hollywood. Oh, yeah. It's right. a special edition of Slime Time Live as they take over Tinseltown. Oh, I need sunglasses. Don't miss it. Tons of Hollywood mess plus a special music video by Dave, Jessica, and Jonah. It's going to be awesome. you got to see it to I believe can't it. wait. All right. That's tomorrow's Slime Time Live right before us here at You Pick Live. Now go to Nick.com and start voting for tomorrow's shows and yes. whatever you want to see. Yes. And we'll see you then. Hey, Arnold's next. Hey, bye.